Well, he served our country and now he's asking for your help. You might be surprised who the Marine vet wants to help, though. 10 News reporter, military, military reporter Hannah Mullins explains he doesn't have much time. I'm failing them, man. I'm failing my family. Once a proud Marine, Chris Guyon is now a prisoner in his own body. My sons have been without their dad for seven years. That's how long ALS and has been killing him. I've been there for him. It usually rips people from their families within two to five years. It gnawed away at his nerves until he couldn't eat, drink, or use the restroom on his own. We lost everything. His three boys gave up a lot to get loans and pay for their own education. And they're watching their dad die and it's miserable. He says he cashed in his life insurance policy in 401k. I love them so much and I want to do more for them. But I can only do what I can do. And uh, that is love them. I can love them. And he clings to what he can do. I can still breathe and speak on my own, but I know that that's fading as well. This right here is a Toby Dynavox. It allows him to make phone calls, write emails, and surf the web. It gives him a little slice of normal. It has allowed me to function more independently. He does everything with his eyes, and it's given him hope. It's a cure. If somebody would hire me, I could work again. He's using it to raise money. He wants to give one to someone else in the shackles of ALS. With everyone's help, I can maybe earn their respect again. Hannah Mullins. And they can feel proud of their dad. 10 News. Well, Guyon has a GoFundMe page to raise money for a Toby device. We posted a link on 10news.com if you'd like to help. Just click the red TV button.